is a two-tailed jig. I think it's about an eighth of an ounce. It's about, I don't know, three, four, four inches, three and a half, four inches long. Kind of craw jiggy, craw jiggy. Working the two-tailed jig and a beautiful trophy. He had to be uh, definitely pushing five pounds, I want to say. Um, could be over, could be under somewhere in there. Could have got something now. Is that wow that's a big pickerel we got, we get this big beautiful that's a nice pickerel big beautiful smallmouth bass with two tail jigs fishing on the lake here and i don't want him to take my jig I, I only brought a couple with me he's like down deep in that grass um fairly light tackle for the uh, um medium light the setup i'm using now and the pickerel, they seem to be active, so we're fishing through these here pickerel. Oh boy, I don't wanna, just want to get my jig back, buddy. So I've been a few pickerel in the mix, and it's interesting because kind of had was thinking smallmouth bass. Don't want you to fall on the floor. Okay, let's get him on his way. And. <laughs> The pickerel, they're interesting because their water tolerance is somewhat the same. The smallmouth bass, they need a little bit more water. But anyway, we get a big, beautiful trophy smallmouth bass. Um, probably an hour into the day. Um, fish like that. You, you, you can go home happy. Like, now. And a tube-tailed jig I've just been primarily working with. You just slide them. Slide them in right there. Really nice. Tans it kind of darts, kind of darts in the water. Um, and then it's got the skirt on the bottom. And you can top that off if you want. It's about one eighth of an ounce. I'm just kind of getting it down, and they do drop fast. That's why I picked it. Back into that. Oh, wow. That's a bunch of weeds on a, on a drop. Hmm. Oh, wow. Got something on the tube jig. What is this? Let me get up here. Whoa! Wow! That is a huge bass. Man, that might be a smallmouth. That's a huge smallmouth, holy. Oh gosh, oh gosh, don't go. I think that is a smallmouth bass and a big one too. Holy, my good Lord. Come on, baby, get up. Everybody wants to see. My God, that's a huge smallmouth! Holy! My God, I am! Oh my God, this is like incredible! Incredible! My God, is he! Wow! Look at the size of that smallmouth! Whoa! I haven't caught one of these in years like this big! My God! He is tremendous. That wow. Oh my god. Oh my goodness. I am like ready to go home. That's like look at a girth on him. My good lord. I need to get a metal. Oh boy. I'm gonna give, give him some water. I gotta. Wow. That is like a trophy. Wow, they get bigger than that, but that is a beautiful, big, fat reservoir smallmouth. That is like a wall hanger. My goodness. I'm gonna, don't worry, I'm gonna get him. My golly. Okay, but he's biting. Beautiful. Look at the girth on him. I, you really have to be here. My goodness. I just want to just look at him more. My golly. Wow. And I set myself up with the Garmin. I seen those that 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 mound. Um, those, uh, that isolated wheat bed and uh, I 
went to a tube tail jig on the bottom just twitching it like I do and wow he really took me by surprise I wow that that's just incredible just wow I've had digger believe it or not um big and small mouth but they, they were river small mouth that's one of the bigger ones I've caught around here they get bigger than that. That, that, that. that fish was pushing up five pounds. I know that. I know that. Incredible. Oh, wow. This is... We're working with with the smallmouth... That big trophy smallmouth bass grabbed. It's a tube jig. Um, they, have, they sink quick. So you get them down. You can see how quick that sinks. I'll show you. They get down quick. And I just give it little twitches just like that as I'm bringing it in and hang it. You can fish them straight down. You can do the cast retrieve, drop, cast, drop, retrieve. Now I did have smallmouth bass on the mine. Um, that's why I bought these two tail jigs. Uh, I was not expecting a, a, a trophy uh, five pound, that's the weeds, a trophy five pound smallmouth bass. Uh, just incredible. That's a fish. Like I said, these pickle are wild, so I think is that a bass? No, oh, that's a pick. What's that? That's a that's a large mount. Um they all share the water this time of year. Wow. Actually I know an area where I think we have a better shot at those small mount, but I'm gonna fish here a bit more. It seems active. So fishing. Like I said, the tube tail jig, and I've been using this today mostly. I've been throwing other things, but mostly today I've been using the tube tail uh, just to get it down quick. Um, tube tail kind of darts and sways, and so I've been get get that jig down, and then I just give it some twitches. And uh, they, they've been biting through with this. Wow, 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 when they start digging, they sometimes they surprise you. He came in a little easy, but now he's, he might have to get the oar in. Wow, my God, that's a big crappie. Holy gosh, huge crappie. Wow, that's probably the biggest crappie of the... Whoa, my goodness. That is a tremendous crappie. My good lord. That is huge. You get a measure on him. That's eight. Sixteen. Wow, he's over he's over seventeen inches. Nuclear. Goodness on the tube jig. Let me see eight. Sixteen. There's about two more. He's almost eighteen inches. My goodness. That is a trophy right there. Don't even fit in the frame. Gosh. Make a nice dinner. Hold on. Beautiful, beautiful, beautiful. Wow, that was some crappie. So he had trophy, big, huge smallmouth bass. Um, pickerel been insane I'm trying to avoid them, but I got a bunch of them, big, beautiful pickerel. And uh, that was definitely a huge, huge, close to 18 inch long uh, crappie. Just tremendous. Um, maybe, I'm thinking if I was in the cove, it could be all really thick, but I'm just going to finish you off here. Something else. What a day. What a day. Big fish and big crappie, big smallmouth bass, big pickerel, and uh, everything else in between.